Hey everyone, I've got a quick bonus video for you this week to talk about how incredibly cool the Fondor Horcraft is in Andor. There will be spoilers for episode 11 here, and a few minor ones for earlier episodes, so if you're not caught up yet, then come back after you are. If you don't care about spoilers and don't know what this ship even is, Stellan Skarsgård's character Luthen Rail uses it to jet around the galaxy, doing on-the-sly recruitment work and such for the early Rebellion factions, under the guise of being an antiquities dealer. But this week we saw its true colours when Luthen was caught unawares by a patrolling Countwell class arrestor cruiser, which locks him in a tractor beam. First, he sets the ship's built-in droid to work on finding him someone else's transponder ID to use, which it does almost immediately while the cruiser takes minutes to check its validity. Then, in a moment straight out of the Winter Soldier, he starts charging up countermeasures while feigning engine problems as cover. He talks up the cruiser captain while he finds out the strength of the tractor beam. He then throttles up, which yanks the entire Cantwell and forces it to up its tractor strength. This was all a ruse, though because the countermeasures are now ready. The first one is a hail of metal shards which, because he tricked them into tightening their grasp with the tractor beam, all get pulled into it and destroy it, a little microcosm of the themes of the show. In response, the Cantwell launches its air wing, but oh ho ho, Luthen is ready for that, and effortlessly takes out half of them with a deployable turret, buzzes the tower on the cruiser, laser beams the rest of the ties, then jaunts off into hyperspace like it was nothing. His Fondor Hallcraft is a goddamn James Bond car in space, and just became the coolest ship in Star Wars. 